Hey everyone, this is Jared Fink with Project 3.0 and today I've got a treat for you all. One of the things I do down here is I go to this place where they kind of teach you how to do session work. It's really a great place to learn how to be a session player and so I'm really thankful that they offer this. It's the local Nashville Union that puts it on. So for those of you that are new to this, I'll try to keep this short because I've, I've, you've probably heard it a billion times, but uh, the basic idea for this has really a lot of takeaways. Uh, it initially started as a way to kind of give people an opportunity to see what it's like to be in a, in a session. Personally, I don't think that's realistic. Um, and it might, you might get some transferred things and concepts that work with that, but I feel like the best part of this is being able to flex your uh, creative brains, uh, getting a chart and making decisions on how it should be crafted and what, how are you going to contribute uh, creatively and musically to the raw information that you are given. So we have uh, a song charted out. Most of them are a Nashville number system, but we also have one that has uh, more straightforward chord changes, and we'll explore that as well. We're gonna listen to a raw version of all of these songs, then we're gonna play through it. Uh, I don't wanna do a whole lot of discussion prior to listening to the scratch track. We're just gonna go for it. And then from there, dig in and see where we wanna go with it. Maybe keep, with, keep what works, change what doesn't. And then once we get something that's formulated into something more unique, maybe we'll take it in a different direction, stylistically. What a, Adrian. Why don't you come on up to the hot seat and uh, we're going to listen to your tune and if you could give us a little background on the tune, like what inspired you to write it and what your thoughts are on it, that would be great. Uh, the song was kind of inspired, I guess, off of Kenny Chesney's Somewhere With You. Scratch it. Then, uh, 11.55 or 1.155. One, one, five, five. Then six minor, six minor, four, four, six minor, and then the next line is six minor, six minor, four, four. I think. Is that, is that what y'all have? Mm. Is that riff that dun 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 okay. dun 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 Yeah. Sent that to you, I just was whipping it out real quick, so.
the thing is, you know, all the stuff that we've done is really just contributions that all of you, I mean, you basically took your inspiration. I, I, I really do nothing other than maybe point some fingers, but the fact is, if you enjoyed anything that you heard tonight, it was because of you and what you created. So, great submissions tonight, great interpretations. It's just great to have all of these fantastic musicians here, yeah. up here, back here, thank you. This one's just about going for it, exploring, and also networking. I mean, feel free to hang out for a little bit, chat, you know, you know, mm. little fellowship. Last thing, if you don't know who Rusty Russell is, just Google him, look him up, and just keep him in your mind. Just He's, he's a dude that's worth remembering, and, and he was a very special guy to this jam. So uh, thank you all for coming, and have a great night. Hey, everybody, a big hand.